Item Number SCP-0002-J Object Class Euclid Special Containment Procedures SCP-0002-J is to be located on Floor 36 of Site-88 in the High Value Containment Division's Communal Restroom. SCP-0002-J use is to be logged on a clipboard, which is to be hung on the outside of the stall in which SCP-0002-J is located. At least one use of SCP-0002-J must be completed daily. SCP-0002-J is a sapient flush toilet located in the High Value Containment Division of Site-88. SCP-0002-J is capable of textual communication through any wirelessly capable device brought into its stall. The device utilized in this manner has a marked effect on the speed of which these communications are accomplished, with laptops allowing the highest value of communication. SCP-0002-J's continued sapience appears to be connected with regular use for its original purpose. When left unused for longer than a day, SCP-0002-J loses all anomalous properties until such a time as it is used again. SCP-0002-J, however, retains knowledge of events that occur in its immediate vicinity during such periods. SCP-0002-J's anomalous properties were first discovered in March of 2016 by Site Director Dr. Philip Foster whilst in use. At the time, it was believed that SCP-0002-J's anomalous properties only manifested in the presence of cellular phones but further testing indicated otherwise. Initial testing revealed the remainder of the object's anomalous properties. The following is a complete log of Dr. Foster's first recorded conversation with SCP-0002-J. Hello? Who is this? Sorry, first time using one of these. Hey, do you think I could write a book about my life? I don't even know who you are. Believe me. I've seen some shit. Identification and containment of SCP-0002-J was accomplished shortly after this incident. <laughs>